all the potential afterlives out there, I quite like the idea of reincarnation. You can keep your heavenly choirs and your burning in the fiery pits of hell. You can keep your feasting in Valhalla. Although I quite like that one, actually. I quite like the feasting in Valhalla as well. That's, that's pretty cool. Although eventually you do have to, you know, die again at Ragnarok. Reincarnation, though, I quite like that idea. You know, so long as I don't come back as something like a mosquito or a sea snake or... A hippo would be quite nice, a hippo. I'd quite like to be a hippo. Someone I knew at school suggested that we get reincarnated as ourselves. We go back to the beginning of our lives. It's an idea that came up again in a book I was reading recently. And it got me thinking. What if that were true? And what if I died and I woke up in my own body, having just been born, with all my memories intact, if I got the chance to live my life all over again. Well, for a start, I'd make sure I wasn't a deformed freak. I'd make sure I didn't have the curved spine. I'd make sure I was tall. I'd make sure my eyesight wasn't so ridiculously bad that I can't see the the camera. I know it's there because there's a there's a a black camera shape in front of the wall. And I know that above it is the Stetson, and up there is a picture I got from the police museum in Manchester. Growing up again, I'd make sure I stayed away from screens. I'd make sure I stayed away from computers. Not entirely, because, you know, you can't stay away from computers in the modern world. It's, it's the modern world. I'd make more of an effort when it comes to women. I'd make more more of myself. I'd get myself out there a bit more. I mean, at the moment, I'm hardly a catch, am I? No woman is gonna... gonna love me. I mean, I'm so ugly that I might as well become one of those nutters who falls in love with an inanimate object. I thought love was only true in fairy tales Meant for someone else, but not for me Love was out to get me That's the way it seemed Disappointment haunted all my dreams Then I saw your face Now I'm a believer Not a trace Of doubt in my mind I'm in love I'm a believer I couldn't leave you If I tried The other thing is The bad childhood I had Knowing now what I didn't then would give me an advantage. I could stop it if I were a child again. I could make sure none of it ever happened. If it did happen, I would be able to go to the police. I would be able to collect evidence. I'd be able to grow up normally with decent mental health. I'd be able to grow up with more confidence. I'd be more assertive. I'd also make sure I didn't go to the same schools that I went to, because the schools I went to were pissing awful. So, I'd make sure I went somewhere else. I'd make sure I did really well on all my exams. I'd make sure I knew everything. I'd make sure I got A's. I'd make sure that when I got to university, I'd still go to the same university. I'd probably still take history. I'd probably still join the student radio. I'd still do everything I did at university because that was the best time of my life and I wouldn't change it for anything but I'd make sure that GCSEs, AS levels, A levels I know they don't matter in the long run but I'd make sure that I got A's in them I'd even make sure I got full marks in all my essays at university I'd start them literally first week of term and then spend one week, thrashing them out, doing a first draft, a second draft, I'd take it so seriously. I mean, yeah, I did alright at university, but I could have done even better. There is a lot that I would do differently. There is a lot that I wouldn't do differently if I were to live my life over again. I'd start certain things earlier, 
maybe. I'd start this, this thing of mine earlier, maybe five, six years earlier. I'd start my, my website bloggy thing a few years earlier. I'd get ahead on where I am in my life now. I'd get three, four, five years ahead. But there are the things I wouldn't change, like university. I wouldn't not do this thing of mine because it's it's a bit too much fun. I get to I get to mess around. I get to do stupid things. When when you're an adult, do you get to do stupid things? Oh, plunder! I know you'll never leave me, will you? We'll be lovers forever, forever. Oh, darling. Oh, darling. Let's elope to San Francisco. That was going to be a brick, but somebody moved the pile of bricks. I was going to do a Father Ted reference as well. I love my brick! I was going to do that, but you can't really do it with a frickin' plunger, can you? I love my plunger! This isn't even mine. I borrowed it. It was just sitting in the bathroom. What was I talking about? No idea, I can't even remember. Living life again. Yeah, I do stuff differently. And some stuff I wouldn't. Maybe I wouldn't try making love to this plunger.